today's 12 Days of Giving is unique. We are featuring something everybody could probably use these days, and that is a better night's sleep. Our 12 Days of Giving hopes to make the holidays a little brighter for our viewers. We are giving away $500 cash for 12 straight shows, and it's all made possible by these wonderful sponsors who we appreciate so much. Today's $500 cash prize is made possible by our sponsor, Novi Oaks Dental. Uh, <laughs> a better night's sleep is something that a lot of people are dreaming of. Often the cause is sleep apnea. Okay, we still got our, um, there you go. Okay, there you go. It, only, it not only affects the person who's experiencing the, speak, the sleep apnea, but also their partner as well. We want to welcome Anju Ely. Thank you so much for being with us, doctor. Hey. Thank you for having me, Tati. How are you today? I'm well, thank you. Thank you. Now, I've heard of sleep apnea, but for those of us who don't know what it is, please give us a quick description. Sure, absolutely. So, Tati, let me answer that question first by explaining what snoring is. Um, I think we all know somebody that snores, right? Uh, <laughs> um, yes. Yes, and so snoring is basically sound that's created by the vibration of the tissues in the back of our throat. So we have a crowded airway, whether it's like our big tongue or our tonsils or our soft palate and it crowds the airway. And when we breathe at night, we get that sound because that airway is crowded, that's snoring. And then the difference between snoring and sleep apnea is when that crowding is so crowded that we actually the airflow is stopped and we can actually stop breathing through the night. And so, and it's not just once or twice, it can happen to you, you know, hundreds of times through the night where you're actually don't have airflow exchange or very minimal airflow exchange. And our body suffers at that point from not getting enough oxygen. It can affect our heart, our brain. Um, it shows up in all different ways throughout the body. Wow, that sounds like something that definitely needs to be addressed. So you're a dentist, and how can you help with this? So, um, Tati, let me say that, you know, there's over 30 a million Americans that suffer from sleep apnea. Wow. And a lot of these people are not diagnosed. And part of that is being able to have enough of these patients screened. And so we can help our medical partners by screening these patients, first of all. So, you know, as a dentist, I see my patients twice a year. They come in, if they're a good patient, they come in for their cleanings twice a year. And I can screen them. I can see if they, you know, a lot of risk factors for sleep apnea show up in the mouth. So that's one way. Another way is we actually provide um, one of the treatments for sleep apnea. So depending on, you know, how many times you stop breathing in the night and how low your oxygen gets and for how long, will dictate kind of the treatment that you should have. And one of the treatments is a CPAP machine, which basically is um, the mask. I know a lot of people say, I don't wanna wear the mask. Well, what we offer is a dental device, and this would be an example of one. So it has an upper and a lower component, and the lower component, it's basically like a mouth guard. So, you know, but it has a top and a bottom piece. And they work by taking your lower jaw and moving your lower jaw a certain degree forward and open to prevent that airway from collapsing at night. Wow, so how does the, how does the process of getting fitted for the device work? Um, so the patient comes in, the first step is getting a sleep study. So we work with our um, physician partners in the area. We, if we screen a patient and they screen positive for you know potentially having sleep apnea, if they tell me they snore, which you know 70% of loud snorers have sleep apnea, so we ask all our patients if they snore, that's first. Once they have a diagnosis, the doctor re, um, decides on the treatment pathway for the patient, whether they're gonna have a CPAP or a dental device. They come in, we um, determine the appliance, we take scans of your teeth, we have some sophisticated airway imaging um, uh, uh, instrumentation that we can use to determine you know, where that patient's lower jaw needs to be to prevent that airway collapse. And then we get you an appliance about three, four weeks later. That's awesome. So it's simple. It's not a, it's not a big to do. It's very, right. it's very simple. And patients tolerate the procedure really well. Okay. So, you know, CPAP is a great therapy, but a lot of patients can't tolerate wearing it. 
Um, most of my patients do really, really well in these dental devices, and um, most of them are singing our praises, which is a good thing. <laughs> well, that is awesome, and, and everyone needs a, a good night's sleep nowadays more than ever before, I dare to say. so. But, Absolutely. Uh, right. Now, a brighter smile, I also want to make sure we talk about this, is a unique, a unique gift for the holidays. What other services do you offer? Because you uh, do a lot more. Oh yeah, for sure. So in addition to um, you know treating sleep apnea and doing dental sleep medicine, we also do a lot of general dentistry, cosmetic dentistry. Um, you know the teeth whitening that we offer at our office is called Glow, and Glow works basically. Um, it is a thirty percent hydrogen peroxide gel that we apply to the patient's teeth, and then we activate that gel with a mouthpiece that the patient wears. Um, they do this in the office for about a half an hour and then they do it for five days at home. So they actually take this home with them. They can do it, you know, they can do it while they're folding laundry. They just wear this around their neck. Um, they wear this around their neck. They press the button, turn the mouthpiece on. It's a really convenient way. Okay. And we decided to offer glow in our office because patients have very little sensitivity. That's awesome. So now, Dr. Ely, we've got about 30 seconds left, but you sure. have something <laughs> that can make people appear very well rested, even if they aren't. Oh, you're talking about Botox, Tati. We do offer um, Botox and Juvederm. So Botox can um, help with the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles and helps freeze some of the muscles so that, you know, we just look brighter and more youthful. And, you know, we need all these secrets and tricks at this time of the year. <laughs> you're like a one-stop shop. Thank you, Dr. Ely. Thank you so much for being with us. Thank you so much for having me. Happy holidays. Same to you. Thank you. Thank you. To see all Novi Oaks Dental has to offer, or maybe as a gift for you or for someone special in your life. And to schedule your appointment, visit the website novicosmeticdentist.com. Again, that's novicosmeticdentist.com. And now it's time to reveal the winner of day nine of our 12 days of giving. This winner will receive a $500 cash prize made possible by Novi Oaks Dental. Let me get a drum roll, please. Congratulations to Melissa Hyren from Romulus. I hope I said your last name correctly. Congratulations to you. We will be contacting you to let you know how to claim your prize. We still have three more days of our 12 days of giving and some pretty spectacular bonus prizes later this week. So you wanna make sure that you continue to join us. It's all made possible by these wonderful sponsors. For your chance to win to enter the contest, go to our Live in the D Facebook page or the contest page at clickondetroit.com. Updated contest rules are posted there as well. This is exciting.